Well, Debbie has been on the road again in the beautiful Bay of Islands. Morning, Debbie. Morning. We went to Pai here and we saw this rare, spectacular waterfall. And have you been to the treaty grounds at Waitangi recently? Well, define recently. Ah, OK. So if you haven't been in the last few months, you need to go again because they have an amazing new museum. Check it out. There's something new at Waitangi Treaty Grounds. This is New Zealand's history as you've never seen it before. The Waitangi Treaty Grounds is a place of significance for all New Zealanders, not just Māori, not just non-Māori. And of course it would only be fitting that we told that story and encompassed and harnessed uh, both sides. This is where old Tonga meets new technology, perfect for the younger visitors. What they know well is TV screens, is tablets, is interactive stuff, touch screens. And so we've incorporated that into the overall experience to capture that audience as well. Get up close to the Treaty of Waitangi using a state-of-the-art interactive display. We've got all of the Langatira names on this particular TV screen which you can magnify to find your Tupna's mark, where they signed it, what place they signed it, what date they signed it, and of course their tribal affiliations. After the cultural performance, always gives me goosebumps, and selfies with the team, ah, that's a pukana, it's lunch at the cafe. Next, find a life jacket that actually fits. And join Bay of Islands Cruise and Kayak through the mangroves. Time for a quick game of limbo. <laughs> Careful not to get stuck. Oh, I'm well and truly stuck. <laughs> cool, guys. We're just going to head on up the Waitangi River up to the Haru Falls. So when we're ready, we'll go and see if we can find the waterfall. Oh. Look out for the cormorants on the way until around the final bend... <laughs> wow, it is. Haruru, meaning big noise, has a shape that's quite rare. There are not many waterfalls in New Zealand that are that true horseshoe shape. Haruru Falls is one of them. You can go under the falls. Today, though, we are content to watch others try it and paddle through the bubbles. When you dry it off, head to the bright lights and warm braziers on the waterfront of Paihia. The alongside bar is a touch of class. The deck runs right out over the water, so sit back in a lounger with your comforter and your cocktail and enjoy that view right over to Russell. When you're ready to fall into a comfy bed, head to the scenic. The secret to the best sleep ever is their feather mattress underlays. Oh, a blankie and a cocktail. That looks perfect. I know. And then the feather underlays on the beds when you get there, you just want to flop after all that activity and pie here. And it's just like sleeping on a pillow. Really great sleep oh, at the nice. scenic. I also really like the look of that kayaking. But when I was watching that with the mangroves, it made me very glad that we do not have crocodiles. Did that go yes. through your head? No. <laughs> it will in the future. <laughs> Thank you. But also in the kayaking, if you want to learn how to paddleboard, if you've never tried stand-up paddleboarding. Which is great fun. Yeah, it is. It's a fantastic exercise and just really gentle exercise as well. The river's nice and calm so it's a great place to learn and they'll take you out and do that with you. It looked like an incredible trip. It was lovely. Nice work. Looking forward to seeing where you go next time. Thank you so much Debbie. Always a pleasure to have you on the sofa.